Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, hello. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Let me introduce myself properly. Um, he introduced me as Kevor Kian. That's not my real name. My real name is Kevor Kian. That's not my real Yes, funny, huh? You can call me Kev. And uh, I come from Armenia, from a very small town called uh, Askrak. And uh, oh, you know this place? Oh, it's wonderful. I used to live in Arthol, but I move, you know, and uh, too many immigrants. And uh, I come to the USA and uh, very happy to be here um, because uh, the owner, Harry, he uh, invited me because he originally found me in Armenia, you know, in the local broth bar. Uh, and he get very excited and he said, come, come, do something in the Love Factory in Las Vegas. And I am here, ladies and gentlemen, and I'm very excited. Now, the thing is, I come because I play the piano. Would you like to hear some piano music? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna do this for you. Uh, this is no, not mine, by the way. This, uh, this uh, crappy uh, keyboard was, uh, no, it's crap. It was, uh, you know, it's crap, I, a classical penis, and they give me this crap to play. And uh, it's your language, I'm just trying to speak it. I, uh, this is crap, and they give this to me. No, shut up, listen. And they give that, please don't clap too much and uh, laugh and everything because the police are looking for me. You know, I need to do this quickly. I. Uh, I, uh, I do this now, they give me this because I have a very big one, you know, and, uh, ah, you dirty cow. But, uh, <laughs> it's like, kumbaya, my lord, going all red, look at that. But, uh, no, no, listen, listen, they are keeping my grand piano, my very grand, big grand piano, they are keeping in the um, uh, Las Vegas airport. They are not letting into this country. So, uh, unfortunately, my mother and father could also not be here tonight. <laughs> anyway, I, uh, no, no, please. I'm, uh, listen, I'm, uh, I'm going to do a piece uh, for you on the piano. I'm going to do this for you because a lot of people say to me, they say, Kev, do you really play with your instrument? And the truth is, <laughs> I do every day. So, uh, so I'm going to do this piece of music, but I'm going to make mistakes so that you know I don't fake it, you know? <laughs> piece with mistakes. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Please sit down, sit down. You know, you know, I, uh, I have to tell you when I come here tonight to do this show, you know, uh, Harry, he said to me, Kev, he said, you really need to play some pop tonight, you know, do something pop, classical, not very good, do pop. I said, I don't do pop, you know, because it's well, the funny about pop, you like in pop. I said, I don't do, you know, because I classically trained on the piano. He said, no, 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 learn something pop and play it for the audience tonight. I said, well, I don't do it, so please help me. He said, no problem. He said, who's your favorite singist? I said, oh, Elton John. <laughs> yeah, because I'm a very big Elton John fanny. So he said to me, <laughs> he said, do something from him. I said, I don't know nothing, you know, I never played with him. So he said to me, don't worry. <laughs> said, huh? He said to me, don't worry, don't worry. He said, I have the Elton John album. I give you the album, you take the CD, listen, copy something. So he give it to me to die, you know? So I take the scratchy CD, and a very scratchy CD. I put it on, I listen, I copy exactly. The way he sing, the way he play, everything. So I'm gonna be playing with myself for you tonight. <laughs> a beautiful song by Elton John called I'm Still Standing. 
I am now Silicao. <laughs> Elton John. I'm still standing. The CD version. Scratches. Like a wind, it's just like ice, and there's a cold, lonely light that shines from you. Run up in the wreck, you hide behind that mask you use. Did you done this for could never win? Did you done this for could never win? Did you done this for could never win? Did you done this for could look at me? I'm coming back again, I got a taste for love. Simple way, if you need to know why I'm still standing, 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 breath away. Don't you know I'm still standing after all this time? Picking up the beep 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 you know, uh, I have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, I, uh, I have privilege of being in this country because I, I escaped Armenia originally, you know, to avoid prostitute, prosecution. I'm sorry. My sisters, they escape prostitution, you don't know, and then they, they come to Vegas and make a lot of money. Now, the thing is, I come, and, uh, and I have to tell you, it's wonderful to be amongst you wonderful people, and I've had the privilege of touring with some wonderful people in my time. And, uh, and I did tour with a wonderful musician called uh, Jerry Lee Lewis. Jerry Lee Lewis, do you know him? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And he said to me once, he said to me, please don't clap by yourself, it's stupid. <laughs> and he said to me, <laughs> he said, Kev, he said, you should always do some boogie boogie. So we rock on the roll and you should get the crowd going, you know? I said, why? He said, because that way they're gonna clap hand, go wild and crazy. So when they leave, they leave happy. So even if you do a clap show, it doesn't matter. Now. I don't know why he told me this. <laughs> but, but tonight, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna finish off by doing some boogie boogie. You know, I, I only have like eight minutes, so I need to do this quick before the police find, you know. So I'm gonna do this for you, and I'm, uh, I hope you enjoy it. Uh, I don't, by the way, I, uh, I don't have any CDs or DVDs for sale. Uh, <laughs> no, no, I don't. Uh, but uh, Harry, he's put, my, put me up in the hotel here. You know, I have a nice room, so. Uh, if anybody needs a nice plasma television or some towels, let me know. <laughs> You've been fantastic, ladies and gentlemen. It's been a real pleasure for you to see me. I, uh... By the way, I don't do one course. I'm finishing this, I'm going, that's it. <laughs> no, seriously. <laughs> because I've been left behind these curtains far too many times, you know, waiting for you people to go more, more, more. Crap, I'm going home. <laughs> You've been fantastic. Shut up, I'm sorry. You've been fantastic. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for that. I'm gonna sit, I'm gonna slap her. Slap her now. You've been fantastic. Look after yourselves. I love you very much. Good night. I'm been Kev Orkian. Take care. Good night. And Kev Orkin right there, everybody. Yes. <laughs> I've been around comedy for a long time. I saw him in the green room and he's like, I'm 
who are you? First of all, what now? I don't like, I still don't know if he's from Armenia or like Reno. I don't know <laughs> what. I'm still confused. Was that an act or was that a real thing? I don't know. I don't, I don't know if he's, who knows? We'll talk to him later. Uh, anyway, you guys ready to see your next comic?